Good morning. Today I'm going to discuss with you an interested case of um, uh, occluded left radial artery, CTO, chronic occlusion, long time, symptomatic. You see the um, uh, ulnar is decent size, nice flow, and um, uh, given collaterals. The flow is still sluggish, as you see here. Started the case from the uh, femoral artery and advanced JR guide. JR guide in the axillary right now. You see injection um, showing severe spasm, some stenosis in the axillary artery, um, and you see um, no flow in the radial. After giving IA nipride and nitroglycerin, you see improve the flow. Then you can advance the catheter more distal to intervene on the radial artery. Here is the distal injection, radial no flow. Chronic occlusion started at the proximal segment. Started the case with run through wire supported by the Turomo 2040 balloon. The run through did not pass distally, inflated the balloon proximal to see if we can improve the flow distal to visualize the true lumen. Still no flow distally. More ballooning in the proximal and mid segment. You have slightly improved the flow, but distal wire still did not go through the um, uh, true lumen. Here you have prolonged um, injection and you see the collaterals and the flow distal. At this point, you see the distal target. We still did not reach her as the wire, did not go through the um, true lumen. Here, advancing the wire, straightening the tip with the uh, 2 0 balloon without inflation, just to support it. Here, you see the run through, went to through distal and pass to the true lumen but it was a through small branch feeding the distal segment of the radial artery if we go back to the prior injection you can tell the run through went through this small branch and make that loop toward the distal segment here is the injection still no flow distally and you can tell the run through not in the true lumen so here i kept the run through in the um, small branch going backward just to guide the other wire and I use different wire. This wire is Turomo, also glide wire 0 0.014 and 300 centimeter with angled tip. Here I supported that wire, the new wire with the balloon, distal, then made kind of like shoulder effect and pushed the M uh, against the CTO cap to the true lumen. Here, distal injection to make sure we landed in the right spot. Readvancing the uh, 2 0 balloon and inflated. Here, upgraded the balloon to 0 0.25, 2.25 balloon. 
pulled the run through, kept only the Turomo wire. Of course, multiple inflation from distal to proximal. And here is the final results. Of course, no need for stenting. No residual stenosis or dissection. And we have nice flow in the whole hand. Thank you and have a good day.